technology for good was a really appealing concept to me. Just getting us to look outward in a transformed way is something I'm very committed to. But what I'm most excited about is what this whole category of digital wellness looks like five years from now, 10 years from now. Our mission is to raise awareness of media that is beneficial. We are a nonprofit. We're also a collective, working actively with artists and researchers to be a hub where people can learn, ask questions, and grow together. Our goal as a community is to uplift and share the stories of creators around the world, to celebrate and highlight the ways that all of us are already accessing healing. Most of what we understand about the way that media affects us has been through a negative lens. Yes, there are corporate forces at will looking to steal all of your attention as their business model, but the flip side of that is just as powerful. We're gonna focus our attention on things that can be beneficial for you. My personal journey into this was I've spent my whole career essentially in video games. So with a lot of those studies that were begun with the idea of why are video games going to be detrimental for youth and their development, it turns out that many of those studies found that a great many video games, they are teaching people things that are useful to their development. There are a lot of examples of media that have proven to actually benefit us and that's very exciting. There are ways that we are accessing healing all the time from music to movies. My life was meaningless. Big reason people come to therapy. Yeah. We've got virtual reality that we now know is helping to reduce pain. Breakthrough therapy results for PTSD from combat veterans. We already have Endeavor RX, the first game ever approved by the FDA to be a prescription medication. We have apps that teach you how to meditate. We have podcasts that show you how to find your community. Share everything. So this is important. We're going to pick up 30 million pounds of trash. Streamers, YouTube stars and Twitch stars and TikTokers using their voices to teach, to help others, to wield that power for good. The research is constant right now. The world has changed. It can change the way we live. And I'm really here for that.